Yes, the uh, Rashtrapati Bhavan Gardens, which will uh, now onwards be collectively known as Amrit Pudyan, uh, uh, are being opened tomorrow by the Honorable President and they will be open this time for two months for the general public from 31st January to 26th March. उसके अलावा हम लोगों ने स्पेशल कैटेगरीज के लिए कुछ दिन रखे हैं 28 मार्च से लेकर 31 मार्च इसमें अलग अलग कैटेगरीज जैसे फार्मर्स हैं डिफरेंटली एबल्ड लोग हैं विमेन हैं उनके लिए एक एक दिन निश्चित किया गया है एंड अपार्ट फ्रॉम दैट दिस टाइम इन आर मेन अट्रैक्शन वन इज दैट वी हैव ट्वेल्व डिफरेंट वेराइटीज ऑफ ट्यूलिप्स एंड दिस विच यू कैन सी दे आर ऑलरेडी सम ऑफ दर इन ब्लूम एंड सम विल बी ब्लूमिंग इन डिफरेंट फेजेस एंड अपार्ट फ्रॉम दैट using latest technology some qr codes have been installed which are also which also you can see on some of the plants about 300 qr codes have already been installed and more will be installed on all the plants of the uh, udyan uh, amrit udyan so uh, any visitor can come and scan the code and they will get uh, all the information about the plant or the flower on their mobile and uh, also apart from this yeah. for the walking visitors we have we will have a self service kiosk which will be installed outside the gate number 35 in order to save the time of the visitors ma'am already are only allowing a public common public to the mogal garden for you now this year are you allowing entire gardens or are you changing any names of the garden no, no. So this time the uh, from this time onwards all the gardens of rashtrapati bhavan will be collectively known as amrit udyan and the visitors can uh, visit the gardens the different gardens of rashtrapati bhavan that is the long garden circular garden and central lawns and all of them and the differently able people visually impaired people will be able to visit the tactile gardens also please take a look at my mic this year ma'am this time you are